it's baking time. That's what it is. So we're creaming some, uh, it is baking time. Bake, baking time. Okay, this is sugar and butter. And now I'm gonna put in this dust of crystallized ginger. Oh yeah. And we are making ginger shortbread. Stay tuned for what they look like. in my apathetic kitchen we never follow a recipe I mean we kind of follow a recipe and then we're like no 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 we change that so today's ginger cookies ginger shortbread which I mean are awesome to begin with um you know we're <laughs> changing the recipe I mean fancy that so last week what you'll never see is that we made crystallized ginger um and it was a bit of a disaster disaster night I mean, if I'm being fair, honest, truthful, um, I tried to throw a carrot muffin into my oven and we almost torched a pan full of sugar and ginger. It was fantastic. So what we have here, <laughs> crystallized ginger. Um, but we had a whole bunch that were, was kind of like too tough to eat. So we sugar fat it. Um, I took about half of that and I put it into the mixture and then I was like, we have a lemon that needs to be used. So let's put some lemon juice in this. It's another lemon ginger and the, the dough's not ginger enough. So now Catherine is grating ginger behind me so that we can add that to the dough. And then hopefully that'll bring it back to ginger status and we'll have lemon ginger cookies, shortbread cookies. Complex enough? Probably. So, let's see how this turns out. Welcome back to my kitchen. <laughs> eating a really hot cookie. <laughs> I'm such an asshole. Uh, so, uh, so these are our lemon ginger shortbreads. This is only half the batch. The other half has gone away already. Um, they're oh amazing. God, we ate well, we ate some. I'm not gonna lie, some, some, not all. So um, these were a success. I will make them again, probably. Um, maybe we'll change the recipe up again. I mean, really, I'll follow the recipe the same way twice. Stay healthy.